Tell me long. Uh, my name is Tammy. If you don't know, now you know. Uh, welcome back. I am, as you can see, washing my hair. I wanted to do another hair wash video since the other one did pretty good. So I figured you guys like the hair wash content. So I figured out a setup and here we are. So yeah, this is my natural 4C hair. It definitely gets loose when the water hits it, but it is my hair. Um, so as you can see, I wet it, saturated it with water, and that was about it. Um, I'm going to add two new products that I'm trying for the first time. Um, it's going to be the Suave line. It says it's for soft and silky hair. This is what it looks like. And I'm going to try the shampoo and conditioner. I've heard good things about it, so yeah. I wanted to give it a try. And the conditioner is basically similar. Sorry, y'all, the fire cook kicks off. So, my hair doesn't tend to get dirty too often, but when it does, I like to try to lightly cleanse it with the shampoo. So, I'm going to do one wash with it because my hair isn't doing that dirty. My scalp gets dirty. Really? I'm sorry, no, my scalp doesn't get dirty. My hair gets dirty, maybe with products, but my scalp really doesn't get dirty. Like, it's really clean. As you can see, there's no flakes, nothing on my scalp. It doesn't get dirty like that. So, yeah, I'm about to take out the process. I'm going to be washing my hair. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And, yeah, let's get back to it. So, I do not have my scrunchie. One second. So, I know I'm going to do one side at a time. So, I'm going to section off it down the middle. I normally just do my hair in two sections. I know I got time for multiple parts. So tonight, I'm gonna section it in two. And the drying will be air dried. Since I did use heat on my front of my head, I was testing out this U part wig that I hated. Um, let's just be honest, I hated it. And yeah, it was a yakky texture. I don't know nothing about wigs, so. I am freezing right now because I'm trying to record this at a different angle in my shower. So forgive me if you see me shivering here because I turned the water off to talk. But anyway, I'm going to just go ahead and cleanse my scalp real quick and let you guys see it. If you see me looking cock at it, I'm looking behind y'all. I have a mirror. So I normally put the shampoo just up here first. And kind of still gentle with my hair to be honest, so I'm not really rough. So I just go in at the roots and scrub my scalp. I know that's really the main part of doing this. And uh, what I do, I take the warm water and I wash the rest off down. So mainly my edges because they go through a lot. Because I do put a lot of edge control on it. So I'm trying not to go crazy with the shampoo. It's definitely blathering up good to say it's only one time. Wow. I like it already. It's smooth. It's really smooth, y'all. I don't know. But to say this is my first time using, okay, so I, I see you both. So, yeah, I'm literally just rubbing it in, as you can see, on my hair. Because, again, I have 4C hair. It don't look like it when it's wet. It's looser. And my natural hair is really curly, has high tight coils. And long story short, I've been natural for 14 years, so I think I know my hair type by now. Um, and you're gonna see sheds of hair flying everywhere because I like to finger detangle. I never use a tool. My hair is fine, so I can't use tools often unless I detangle it once after stretching it, and that's it. I can't keep using like combs mainly because it'll pull my hair out. I can't believe combs pull my hair out so it is what it is but I've learned in order to retain my length that it is and get it to this length it really would have been longer because I've transitioned over the years and pulled my hair out so no. it would have been longer but I cut it a lot see I didn't get any in the back so I'm gonna add a little a little bit more to get the back Again, I'm just applying it to my scalp right now and my edges mainly. One side. But it's already frizzing up. And guys, you want to make sure you have no jewelry on, no earrings. When you have fine hair, you got to do what you got to do 
So I need no snags. So this is what this side looks like. And to be honest, this side is my looser texture. My hair is two different hat types. This side, it's still 4C, but it's looser, if you can't tell already. My curl on this side is looser, if you can see it. Yeah, definitely looser, looser pattern. So I'd say this is 4B, maybe. So yeah, 4B hair. And this is literally just with shampoo, nothing else. I'm gonna rinse it out in just a second, I'm gonna do the other side, so. Try to do the other side real quick. I like to do them separate and still pull them together if that makes sense. So I won't over do it. Um, no, 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 this is not a stretch, this is a headband. So, see, so I'm gonna go figure. Alright, so I wet both sides already, so I don't have to do it again. So let's get to this side. Shampoo. I'm not about to. Oh, I knew we were gonna come at somewhere. And of course, it had to be my face. So, oh, what's that? This is my true, true 4C side. If you can't tell already, it's already matted. Nowhere near loose. My other side is obviously looser, as I said. And forgive me guys, again, if I look weird, I do wear eyeglasses, so I may look a little weird trying to strain to see. Sometimes I might be squinting. <laughs> but yeah, I'm not really adding extra. I'm just going out with the product that's already at the roots. Just massaging it with the um, this part of my hands, and my nails are not snagging anything. Oh, it's, it's just so good, good though. So I do scratch it with my nails just a little bit because I am tender headed, so I try not to do too much scratching. But yeah, and this side is obviously 4C. If you can't tell, look at that. There's no separation like the other side. This is my. 4C side. So yeah. I'm about to wash it out now. I think I'm gonna start on this side. I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna start on the left side all the way anyway. So but you can definitely see how soapy it got. I don't know why, but it did. But anyway, yeah. Go ahead and get to washing it out now. Again, I like to work. See the difference. You see it? One side is more looser, one side is more chunky. Like I said, I know my hair, literally two different hair patterns, and this is just shampoo. So, all right, let me start washing it out.
real fast so you can see it I'm gonna start with my 4C side this time as y'all can see I'm not being rough or nothing I'm just letting the water go through it the more you manipulate it the more tangles it'll get so I'm trying my best to do very little of manipulation while it's wet I even gave y'all a little lens check, so I don't really know how long my hair is, to be honest. I don't, I don't keep up with it like that. I just like healthy hair. Anyways, next is conditioner. Oh, that scares me every time. All right. Now this. Again, I'm trying out this line for the first time. It was an all recommendation by a family member. And it looks like it's an awesome recommendation because my hair is loving it right now. It smells good. OMG. I like the way it smells. I don't think it's all natural hair. I'm gonna use a heck of a lot of conditioner. I mean, I use a lot of shampoo, but I'm gonna use that conditioner. It smells so good, oh my goodness. This technique to make sure I'm getting all the in between pieces. As long as I'm gonna kind of manipulate it just a little. And then once again, I finger detangle. My back is always shorter because I got cut a few years back. I had a little under cut in the back of my head, so my nape is always shorter. But I can tell my techniques that I'm doing my hair works because my nape. It's definitely longer. It took about three years for it to grow back like this, so yeah. You can definitely see your care of your hair if you cut it off. I always hold it and look a little bit like that. Look at that. I'm gonna lightly finger detangle it because I don't wanna again. I prefer not to do a lot to my hair when it's wet or damp or when I'm in the shower. And my hair is fine. It takes more delicacy with it. As you can see, I'm gonna feel snag and stop. So it's just how long. Use that to get all the tangles, and that's it. That's all I'm 
first time I ever use it, so I'm done with this side. Make sure I go with the other. Look at that. So yeah, already detangled. So I'm gonna wrap it. Sometimes I let it sit for a while. Sometimes I don't. To be honest, I don't always do it when I'm just trying to get the hair day over with. So in this case, it's not gonna sit in, but for the time it's taking me to do the other side, I'm gonna wash it right on out. So do not think you gotta deep condition every time. You do not. I don't. I do it maybe 80% of the time, and the other times I don't deep condition. I feel like my hair is soft already, so I don't have to do it that much. Unless it's bone dry, then I'll decondition. Alright. This is how that starts from the top instead of the bottom. I can do the other side because, again, this side is looser. So I can get to. I can get to the roots easier. This one from this side of me. Again, if I'm cross sided, don't judge me. I'm not wearing my eyeglasses, so I can't really see anything. <laughs> so don't mind me looking weird. But as I'm doing this, I am finger detangling it. This side obviously never get as single, because again, my looser side. Okay. And I'm gonna have to probably do this in two parts so you can see what my hair looks like after stretch. So I can show you what it looks like after doing the banding method. So stay tuned for the banding method. I have a video already on my shorts and I actually posted one so if you want to see a quick version of it you can I heard a pop so I did snag a tangle this down but I didn't even want conditioner so I'm gonna go ahead and warm up in alright this stuff works good it's protein supposedly in it too so it's a nice little protein treatment rice water with onion juice I mean onion juice rice water with onions in it soak for two days maybe to pop and then I use that as my protein treatment of course I dilute it because again my hair is neck fine but I want it strong and I can feel I can kind of tell when my hair is ready for a protein break treatment because it feels brittle and weak and to be honest I think it's time for another one because it's been like two months I do it once every two months my hair responds well to protein it just gotta be not too strong. Let's go break it off. So yeah, my protein of choice is rice water. If you're wondering, but this stuff works good too. I can I can kind of feel like it feels thicker since I washed it with the shampoo and now I'm doing it with conditioner. So my hair does feel thicker when it's actually not. <laughs> it's like medium strands. I'm not gonna say it's fine, fine, fine hair, but it's medium, and that's only because I started using rice water a few years back. Before it was like brittle, then brittle, fall apart, then. So, as you, you're not noticing already what I'm doing, I'm detangling it with my fingers, going down, starting from the roots, going in parts and pieces. I always use my thumbs as like a final, you know, not to the bottom type of technique, and then I go with my other fingers like a comb. But I don't use a comb because I can feel the knots. So, yeah. Little cheat sheet when you're washing, not detangling your hair in the shower. You don't always need tools, to be honest. If that's tools, those are the ones that God gave you. I feel every knot right here, so I'll pause and I'll take my time to separate it and go back. So, yeah. If you ever wonder how you detangle your hair in the shower, this is what I do. My hair cannot take combs. If I use a comb or a tool, I truly feel like my hair will be out. I tried that and it just yanked my hair. It really did. It really just yanked all my hair. Yeah, the conditioner can have a lot of slip in it, but I 
just prefer not to. It's just a preference. I'd rather do the safest route and use my feet. So, you won't see anything used in this video except my hands and some scrunchies. Or hair ties. Not scrunchies. That's really it. Maybe a few products as well, of course. I feel all the knots back here. I don't know if you can see. All the little knots are back here, but I've already worked them out now, so can't see them as much, but they're there. See, I feel a whole bunch of tangles. Again, I'm going through it gently, not rough at all. And see how the bottom of my ends look stringly? That's the knots. All the knots coming out. So, yeah. I don't do go crazy with the detangling. I do just enough to get the knots out so that way when I wash this conditioner, oh, see, see what's doing out right there. Look at that big old knot. Hold up. You don't see that? Look at that big old knot. That's a knot. That's a knot. <laughs> so, gently, because I did it with my fingers, I can kind of, kind of still tug it and then it comes right out. Look at that. And that's shed hair. So, yeah, that's why I prefer. This is all the reason why I prefer. This is all if you're new to the natural hair. Of course, if you're been natural, you already know this and you just can skip past all of this if you don't care or mute me. <laughs> but um, yeah, just want to help the girls, curl girls, curl friends that don't know how to detangle their hair. The best way to use, the best way to start is your fingers. So all jewelry are going, I don't have any earrings in, no rings, nails are trimmed have no issues so you shouldn't either take your time don't rush it all right my hair wash will only take I'm not deep conditioning and if I'm not sitting under the dryer to be honest all it takes 30 minutes tops so it's only taking as long because I'm recording so and I'm just rubbing it down my ends since I did all that work so now I can take this one down and kind of go back over it one more again. And I'm done. Now my ends again. This is my kinky kinky. So my ends over here are going to be right back tangled. This is why I know that I'm definitely for C because these ends don't play. They do not play. And they don't want to let go. Oh, they're not letting go. They don't want to let go. <laughs> But anyway, all right, time to wash the condition out and I'm gonna go ahead and band my hair and probably two good pigtails like I did last time. That's the easiest way to stretch it for me. Now I might do more than two this time, I might do four. Four good, good pigtails and then um, I'll be done with my hair. I'll just come back when I look like an alien, to be honest, because that's where, why. Again, I don't have my glasses on, so if you see me looking down, Forgive me again. Um, try to make sure I'm not cross-eyed. Because <laughs> again, I don't have my glasses. I don't, I'm blind as a bat. So, ooh, that itch. Anyway, forgive me. And if you can't tell, my hair is clean. All right, I'm going to go ahead and wash it out. Talked about this much hair. If you just Not a lot. Not a lot. Not a lot.
definitely go back and look, look at that one. But it's simple. All you do is put rubber bands on the ends of your hand, on your hands, on the roots, and all the way down. Uh, not rubber bands, uh, hair ties, and go all the way down. And excuse me. And I use very minimal products on my hair, um, leave-in and oil. That's it. That's all I put. And yeah, that's it. My hair is soft. That shampoo and conditioner was well. Oh, it was so good. So good, guys. Like, look at this. See the bounce? And of course, this is my loose I added this to try my kinky. Look at that. OMG. Who said that wasn't for natural? If you want to try it, y'all, it's not sponsored. I just decided to pick it up on Walmart. The Suave Silk Protein line. You ladies have to try it. Men, you have to try it. This works really good on natural 4C hair. Um, so, yeah. I tried it. I love it. I'm definitely using it again. It's awesome. My hair feels really bouncy and groovy. You see this? This is literally no product. My hair is just wet. I'll show you back. Show you just real. The moment the water goes away, this is how I know I'm 4C right here. See? And this is how you know I'm fine. My hair is fine. Hair is done. Wash. Clean. The moment the water stops, the hair Gotta find my way to you Even though you're next to me